Late last year, I saw an ad for the Tom Studio Lumos pen, and I just had to have one. This pen is refillable, and it works with fountain pen inks, with multiple interchangeable tips. My first pen came malfunctioning, and I was unable to get it to work. The Tom Studio team kindly sent me a replacement, so let's try this again. This is the Lumos Mini Pen in matte black. In the box is the pen, black ink, and a beautifully illustrated info sheet. The pen is made up of several parts. The pen cap and the pen body are threaded. On the inside, there is a refillable ink reservoir and a pen tip holder. I'm going to be testing the pen out with one of my favorite inks, the Sailor Manyo Hinoki. I have a little bit left of the 3 milliliter sample that I bought from Yosaka Stationery. To fill the pen, I dip the reservoir into the ink and let the capillary action bring the ink upwards. After filling in the ink, I'm putting the pen back together by twisting the pen tip holder into the pen body. The pen's cap can be twisted into the back of the pen to add a little bit of length when posted. The pen feels good in my hand with its weight. The length is short, but it doesn't feel too awkward to me. This is the default pen tip that comes with the pen. It's a 0.3 writing tip. The pen feels like a typical felt tip pen, not unlike a Stabilo. The ink looks quite different from my fountain pens due to the lower amount of ink that is placed on the paper from the tip. For comparison, I'm currently swatching the ink with my Sailor Hokoro dip pen with a Fude tip. You can see that there's much more variation in the ink color since the ink is pooling on the paper. The pens are used for different purposes, and I like that the Lumos fills a new niche that didn't exist before. It's a game changer to have a felt liner that can be filled with any of my fountain pen inks. Along with the pen, I also purchased the full creative tip set. The tip set comes with nine different tips. The 0.1, 0.2, 0.3, 0 0.5, 0 0.8, 1.0, brush, 2.0 chisel, and bullet pen tips. I'm going to try the brush tip and see how that performs with the ink. To swap the tips, I unscrew the pen tip cap and pull out my current pen tip. Then I add the new pen tip and screw the pen tip cap in place again. Now I'm waiting for the ink to fully move up the pen tip. I love that a different pen tip makes such a difference in the ink color. All three of these ink swatches look different, even though it's all the same exact ink on the same paper. I'm really excited to play around with the Lumos Mini and all of my inks and pen tips. I feel like there are so many potential uses for this pen. It's super flexible for different needs like drawing, inking, and writing. What do you think about the pen? Would you get one?